With Rex and Roberto Carlos and Claflin in the back. When Claflin played uh, in Stamford Bridge, he played on the wing, so he's playing central defence. Uh, O'Reilly and Gilligan, the full-backs, then a midfield three of uh, Maisie Adams, uh, Patrice Everett and Noah Beck, who very much was a lot of people's man of the match last time out, incredible player. And then, wow, that's, that's not a bad front three, is it? <laughs> Totti, Crespo and Bolt. Uh, of Neville, Cahill and Bugsy, who apparently is, quote-unquote, a unit. Then uh, <laughs> the midfield of Hiddleston, who is, has got a great engine himself. Ah, God's child, Jack Wiltshire. Uh, <laughs> Jill Scott, the skipper, and Corey there on the right. And then up front, Hayne Defoe and Grennan. Old Trafford in Manchester. The home of Manchester United, the original soccer aid. And tonight, the home of the 12th meeting of stars, celebs, and football legends. Soccer aid for UNICEF. Stepping out on their latest adventure. And alongside me in the commentary box, fresh from a rather interesting first week in the Villa, Ian Sterling. And about time that England had a win, I think. I think it's been, was it, four in the bounce for the rest of the world, so I think England will be hungrier than ever to uh, bring it home. So desperately want to, some of the celebs, this is the biggest game of their lives. Anyone who watched Harry Redknapp lose his temper over a goalkeeper last season, boxing boys, Champions League winners mixing with tune spinners, and the King of the North, and the Queen of the Jungle. This is Jill Scott, the captain of England. And trying to go for the chip, and then we got married yesterday, has just given the ball away. And here's Liam Payne, a chance for him early on. Well, he did catch it, but it was... This is Totti. And this is Crespo, and David James is equal to it. Tossi Crespo, James. 100 appearances for the US women's national team. That's a lovely touch by Usain. You ain't gonna add it on Usain, Usain Bolt. And here he is. Usain Bolt versus Gary Neville. And it's Usain Bolt off the post. David James breathes a sigh of relief. He'll try and apply yeah. the foe, but an acrobatic clearance from Everett. I don't care how fast he is. Get in though, look. No, 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 nothing, nothing's happening, nothing's happening, nothing's happening. Nothing's, I told you. It's nice and calm, yeah? It's all good. Where do you want to go to your honeymoon? Old Trafford, you go sit in the crowd and we'll, let's not speak for four days. <laughs> yeah, Maisie. Uh, Sam, you were there and that's all that matters. That's about it, I'm afraid. Here's Bolt. Oh, oh. He is playing the advantage. Darren Fletcher has helped it, and this is Maisie Adam. Oh my God! So close! What a wedding gift that would have been. Well, that was four, 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 two. You'll be put through to our appreciation station, where you might be able to speak to one of our celebs. The manager's getting involved. Look at that touch from Poch. Noah Beck, getting away from Buxy Malone. It's Noah Beck. He's That's gone down under the. Ball. Challenge it's a stone wall. Gary Cahill. The end of last year, that was a mistake by Everett. And now Jermaine Defoe is onto it. And this is Liam Payne trying to poke it through. And speed over the course of the training week. I tell you what, I was in the gym this morning next to Mo Farah running a 5K. Pulls out for after this. Here's Bolt released against David James. Slips it past David James and scores at Old Trafford. The first goal of Soccer A 2023. Goes to Usain Bolt, the world's fastest man, a Manchester United fan, desperate. Few to aim at for Jack Wilshire, who curls it towards Jill Scott, the headers from Gary Cahill. Towards uh, Usain Bolt again, Gary Neville's got uh, something to worry about. He's passed him. And it... Yeah. What did you feel? Tell us, talk us through it. <laughs> my Achilles tendon's been injured all week, so I felt something shoot on my leg. As you seen for the key to it. Look at Karen Carney making a dart. Defoe might be in behind here. He's got the first touch. Everett's to Nanny. It's still Nanny. Testing nice. David James, who makes a decent stop. Gilligan after having to be replaced after 40 minutes last time around. Oh my god, what just happened? Samo with a little trick to take him they're, past Totti. They're all at it. Oh, he's still going. He'll outrun you. 
It's Tommy Fury. He can't touch Tommy. Russia blood there. Russia blood. Well, we know he can hit better than that. Well, Everett leaving it for Tossi. He's going to hit it, you know. Takes a deflection and almost wrong footed David James. And Totti bangs it too as well. The camaraderie at Soccer Aid always good. Brennan looking up at that clock, just begging for it to be over. Nothing left in the tank. Here's Karen Carney trying to take on Ben Foster. And Kearney on to Grennan. And yeah, Karen Carney yeah. has been knocked to the floor just outside the penalty area. He's had some big moments at Soccer Aid, but it's Wilshu who's going to strike it. And miss the target. And Chunks is looking at him like I would have buried. Balletic feet. Paddy McGuinness, I think, may have touched that after it had gone over the line. The referee consulting, it's going to be... Nanny. Middleson couldn't keep hold of him. And this is Totti. Oh. Now Wilshire. England got a lot of people committed towards the edge of the penalty area. And this is Butterfield! Oh, Sliced it! Bunt scored it! Ace of Butterfield off the bench! England on the score team, and look at what it means. Carney on the ball, Karen Carney. Driving forward with Hiddleston outside it. In towards Grennan. Just left Mufara and he's weak. Here's Kemp, looking for the record. Grennan, lovely ball, Hiddleston coming. It comes back to Scholes, it's in. Mistake by McGuinness. Dawson has given it to Mack. And then Gary Cahill. Totti. Play continues. Paddy McGuinness. Oh! Tries to get something on it and just about nudges it behind. What? Up. Going on. Bruce, what's happened to your team? Yes, I've seen the England increase the tempo. And for us, it was difficult, but. Come on. Ah, you need to finish yeah, that. We need to score. We need to score. More clinical. I've seen we. Create a lot of chances in the first half on only one we can score uh, through Sain. But yes, okay, now I think we need to increase the, the tempo and for sure we are going to score. Well, you know you won the last four, yeah? Sorry? You've won the last four. Ah, uh, yes. Just no pressure. No pressure, okay. Well, well no we see it's still, it's still time eh, to play, yeah? Trying to probe his way through. This is Ken Saturday. Testing Paddy McGee. Just had a few moments ago. Here's Everett. Back to Robbie Keane. It's Keane. Oh, it's a beauty. It's a beauty. It's the full force of Robbie Keane. And the World Eleven are level. The Irishman does it again. He scored an up. Oh, and Tom Aberdeg. Aluko. Fancying her chances. Aluko. Trying to find Grennan, she might just have done it, you know. Edwards came out very quickly. Great bit of goalkeeping that. Confident, down at Tom's feet and snap. Through alongside him, this is Keane. Lee Max to his right. Paddy McGuinness flapped at it. Nico Milano was coming in. Harry Redknapp and Emma Hayes bringing on Jermaine Defoe to replace Michael Dawson. A great ball. Headed away by Cahill, comes back to Ebra, cleared away by Cahill again, and tracked it brilliantly by Robbie Keane again. And they're back in front. Any mark celebration from was, Robbie Keane. I was about to say it was lovely to see the little forward roll. Oh, oh chucked with a back header, which is stopped by Edwards, just about. Look at this. Christensen. Nanny testing Paddy McGuinness and missing the target. Game set tonight. Here he comes again, trying to bend one. And, oh. Well, he's pushed it around. Has... Sizing up a shot, it's Nanny. Oh. As he had in 2021. They were better after half time. This is Nico. Farrah. Yeah. Not oh. the best touch, and now. After it running loose, Kenny's away. He's got 
five on his mind. This to finish it. It's Kem for the record. And Kem, most likely for the win. Wilshire looking for Jermaine Defoe. For it, Mauricio Pochettino is certainly enjoying himself. Melsi, this is Nani. And now Robbie Keane. Great work by Farrah. And she does not look happy about this result so far. Ains Chunks looking for Jermaine Defoe. Ever trying to get back at him, does brilliantly. Luca's coming across here, but Ever once again.